The treated potion Satcha Curiosity is going to be one of the main items that's going to be permanently added to the game that allow us to increase our consumable inventory capacity. Basically, it allow us to increase our potions, our high potions, and so on. So today in this video, I'll be showing you guys how to get this treated potion such a curiosity. And with that being said, let's get right into it. So the first thing I want to mention is that you got to progress mid to the game, to the mid game. And you have to collect this quest here, which is located at the hideaway. So this is the quest we have to collect here. It's called Weird Science. It's available during the main quest out of the shadow. Here, Sid, reckon you might be. And, and a good hunting, eh? So we're gonna quickly accept that quest. It's called Weird Science. Prioritize that quest. Then we're gonna walk our way to the hunt board to locate the Bomb King. Talk to Nectar. Ask about bomb sightings. Nectar's gonna refer us to the hunt board. Last notorious mark there. The 13. The bomb king. Located a croc Sambert here. So from the map here, from the hideout. Sorry, from the hideaway. We're going to be working our way to the Dragon's Array. Let's quickly travel there. So this is the route here I'm going to show you guys. From the Oblix. Working our way all the way here. South. Right here where I place a marker there. Let's try it. So just follow the route guys, stick with this path here, try to avoid all the enemies as, if possible. Then from the path you're going to detour, cut across here to this next path. I'll continue with this path here now. Straight ahead, just keep on falling apart. Just slide left here. Gonna see a broken gate. Enter the broken gate here. It'll be in this forested area here. Keep on with the path, go straight ahead. Just keep on with the path. Right, coming up right here, make a hard left. Let's get to see right there. There's some marker here. We're getting closer. So we finally reach our destination here. Got this item here, whatever it is here. Alright. On the ground here, yeah, and if you guys can see him, that's uh Bomb King, I guess he's sleeping. Let me awake him here real quick. That's the Bomb King rank B, Notorious Mark, number 13 on our hunt board. Quickly deal with the Bomb King. It's gonna be a little tough to deal with. He's gonna have all the spawns, spawn on all the bomb kings, and watch out for those little floating new bombs here. If you hit, I think it's even a lot of damage. So let's try to avoid all that. Yeah, I play very tactical against the bomb king. The 
bomb king could be a very a challenging guy so make sure you have enough high potion and potions especially when he spawns like that yeah, and there's a lot mess around him. you gotta dodge a lot on a lot of attacks this bomb if he spawns they happen to explode a lot and they do a lot of damage There you have it. About to defeat this notorious map number 13, which is our bomb king. This is as we get there, the bomb ember. That is also used to craft the Excalibur. Which is gonna be covered in the next video. You guys can check it out if you do it in the screen. I'll leave it in the end screen for you. So here we have the gather the bomb ash. So this is one here. One, two, three. Check around here. Two more on the side here. So let me collect this one here. Two with one here. That should do it. The wine needs more than this. Alright, we have all collected now. So let's make our way back to our hideaway. I'll show you guys the route in case you guys don't know how to get there because I didn't happen to show this in the beginning how to collect the weird science side quests if you guys don't know how to get there I'll show you guys exactly how to get there the route right now I'm going to deliver the bomb ash to Owen in the hideaway so this is the route here so just follow me guys So this is where the quest is also located, if you don't know how to get here. So let's speak to him real quick. All right there, Sid. How's that hunt for the bomb ash going? I have it here. So here we're going to hand over those three bomb ash. So we hand over the quest is completed. And we're going to receive a reward which is going to be the treated potion satchel necessary for increasing consumable inventory capacity as you see there so now our inventory has increased so this is the item capacity you have obtained a treated potion satchel here by increasing your capacity for carrying consumables. Item stock increases are as follows. Potions went from 4 to 6. High potions increased from 3 to 4. Strength tonic increased from 2 to 3. And stone skin tonic increased from 2 to 3. If you guys found this video very helpful, give it a thumbs up. Share it to your friends that play Final Fantasy 16. And subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. I'll see you guys in the next video. You guys take care.